Okay, in this video I just wanted to explain to you how the user interface in Curve Expert is organized. There's basically four main areas in the Curve Expert main window. The one here is the results pane, I'll call all of these panes, which show all of your results. And then in the preview pane below, you'll see a quick preview of any result as you drag your mouse over that result. In this area is, is the graphs and data. Um, pane and here you've got your data spreadsheet any notes you might have you know, a data plot top results and any other plots that you might have created right along the way okay you can also rename these tabs okay um, and you plot one or something like that okay so just so that you can keep track of which plot is which in your sequence of tabs okay also you have the messages area that basically tells you any information that Curve Expert is trying to communicate back to you. All right. So, you know, and you can obviously scroll that and copy data from it with just a cut and paste if you like. Um, the toolbar buttons, uh, you've got uh, for the calculations anyway, you've got linear regression, a nonlinear regression, splines, and smoothing. And each one of those maps directly to a menu choice off of the calculate menu. Okay. Another useful thing is that you can maximize uh, these windows to get a bigger view. If you'd like to maximize your results pane to get a bigger view of those, fine, you can do so. The most useful one really is the graphs and data where you can basically look at your entire graph in a much bigger version, change uh, graph properties uh, if you like and things like that. Now as soon as you hit the restore button over here, it'll just restore back to its own uh, original size. Another nice thing is that all of these windows, except for the graphs and data one, are uh, uh, you can rip these out basically. All right, so if you click and drag and move these things around, you can dock them on other parts in other parts of the window, but you can also tear it out and leave it out so you can split these um, these windows out, you know, based on however you like them to be arranged. And then when you'd like to snap them back in, you can either select Window Dock All, or you can just drag them back, and you'll see the little highlight, which is you know, telling you where the dock is going to happen. So if you want to put your results over here, for example, and put your preview on the right, you can certainly do so if that is your preference. And you can use these sashes as well to move these, um, uh, to move the proportions around like you like it. And all of these uh, windows are saved on um, on Exit of Curve Expert and restored upon entrance. And that's it for the UI uh, demo. Uh, until next time, thanks.